Look at me when you mm -hmm. this. <laughs> Seriously, okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, okay. I will. Oh, you want to be like that? Yeah, so you are covering my tummy. Why, why does your tummy need to be covered? Because I'm, I gain, uh, everybody thinks that they are gaining weight, so. Who is, no, tell me, who is everybody? You have not even been in videos for so long. I don't know. <laughs> Last time I was in video, people would say that. <laughs> you would also say that my tummy is growing. Oh, yeah, but. But we are pregnant. pregnant. Yeah, yeah, and ah, so, so I'm pregnant as well. Ciao, ragazzi! And welcome back to Lampies! And guess who is joining me today? Yes, de pa Desaparecidos. I was. Eh? Desaparecidos. Was a, yes, it means like a mist, like I disappeared. <laughs> From the channel but it's still living with me i know there has been already some situation concerns it's still living with me mm -hmm. yeah i, I, I mean, mean where I, you go in the bed <laughs> corona, where should i go i don't know but yeah um, i live between uh, the sitting room there with my desk and my computer and the bedroom that is mainly that is I actually live. true so 12 hours seated uh, yeah like and seven hours there so then, now uh, sleeping and maybe I would say twelve hours. Uh, now to I'm fourteen not. during the week. I also go like for twelve hours seated because from seven to seven basically, and then maybe we have three or four hours like one during the lunch break and then uh, maybe two or three hours before we go to sleep. <laughs> that is my week, including Saturday and Sundays. It has been a little bit challenging, but I'm trying my best. Okay, I thought it's your hobby, so I think it's not my hobby, it's uh, my work. It's your work. So, please, I would need help. You know, the, mm -hmm. the new way of uh, making sure that my hair is moisturized and looking beautiful. Uh, okay, I so I should no, no! <laughs> <laughs> hey, I was joking, come on. <laughs> no, I don't know that. So, <laughs> So you think I'm going to go ahead? Yes, uh, and still I'm pregnant. Do not yeah, play with my nerves, please. <laughs> yeah, I see. <laughs> like, guys, you cannot imagine how much she is like sensitive and touchy during these final days. Yeah, you don't want to know that, but it is like. <laughs> <You're> <laughs> what? I'm not joking. Why are you laughing? Don't throw, don't You're still me. hiding your tummy. Like, no, baby. <laughs> no, <laughs> Absolutely. Oh. <laughs> no, I need that thing a little too long, please, for my pillow bed. You're serious about this one? You know, soon lockdown is going to be. How long do you go to the office? No, I just need to stop, really go for a run, maybe in the evening. When it's not if really I get time. Yeah. Okay, great. So, you dip in a bit and scalps. Because it gets really freaky. Do not pull. <sighs> okay, so tell me. No, you are at the salon. Tell me all the, <laughs> no, the, the crazy secrets. <laughs> of who is marrying who? <laughs> who has been divorcing during Corona? <laughs> what, what is, no, yeah, let's talk about your, 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 your new favorite podcaster. You need to know that, like, uh, <laughs> now I, should, I think I should be jealous because she's. But you are also watching Joe Rogan. How. Oh, yeah, but Joe Rogan is a male. And, and so, why males don't fall in love with other males? No, it's just that I'm not gay. So I, I don't know that you're following Joe Rogan 24 7. Ah, okay, so uh, I should be considered gay just because I'm listening to a podcaster, but you are listening to this, so, this group of guys <laughs> no. that I don't know really. Should I be jealous? What is the name of uh, your the favorite podcaster? Uh, nothing really. <laughs> you know, you, you were saying something very relevant that uh, you, I mean the salon now I could give all the juices about who divorced and <laughs> who divorced during the co Mm -hmm. the corona. During the corona. Because I feel like that is definitely going to be the real conversation in the saloons when everything opens. Yes. Do you miss saloons? I haven't been in a saloon in a very, very long time. I usually, the only one that I got is for waxing. 
But uh, the ladies usually speak mainly Portuguese and they do not speak to me. They only speak with other ladies that I was communicating to them in Portuguese. Okay, so... And yeah. waxing does not take... It's not long enough for you to really gossip. Plus you are screaming because you are, it's painful. So, so over a year, I'm mm -hmm. thinking if you are single, mm -hmm. People who were single last year, January. Yes, they still single. <laughs> no, maybe yeah, they're no, really, yeah, they're dating online. Yeah, they are dating online. Come on. That is huh? true. We are but in 2021. That People is. are dating online. So no, I'm yes. thinking, if you just met mm -hmm. somebody somewhere between January last year, mm -hmm. then maybe you, or you met in Febru February last year and you mm -hmm. moved in together end of February last year or early March last year, uh -huh. that means literally a year now in your relationship you have not even gone on a date other than just go for a spasiering outside. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh, it sounds like uh, it's going to be over very soon because you are already bored with the person. May not worry. Fortunately, the, the vaccine is going to save us all. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yes, but and do you get what I'm trying to say? Yes, I'm because at the beginning this. of the relationship, that is everything exciting. Your girlfriend or your boyfriend is taking you out. You go on dates. You're going to Mallorca. Yeah, whatever. that is not even the case anymore in our times. Come on, people mm -hmm. are even if there was no Corona, people were still just being meeting people online in our days. Yeah, but when you meet online afterwards, you meet the person in person. Mm -hmm. Can you please hold? But now I feel like it's only online. Okay. Ah, you are, are there some that have um, twisted themselves? No, I'm making like uh, one out of three. Uh -oh. do you do? I have to exercise for Lily. Okay. Yeah, so I was thinking it's tough and we are married and we've been living together mm -hmm. already for a while and I'm telling you mm -hmm. For us, it has also been at times just difficult. Oh, I haven't noticed that. Oh, you are lying. Because I think at the end of the day, let me say, especially on a Friday, you're frustrated because it's it's weekend, mm -hmm. but you still feel like you are stuck in the now home office situation. You need to be a little bit more still. Am I not still? No. Okay. <laughs> And if I put you in that position, please okay, say that. Good. Oh, oh. Okay, tell me, what were you saying? I was saying, like on a Friday, it's very frustrating because it's just end of your working day, long working week, and you just want to relax, but you don't know how because you're just stuck at home, and home is also now office. Yes, I, that is an old story, to be honest. Um, for story. me, for me, I'm already dreaming about uh, trips and <laughs> everything. The reality of facts for us is going to be that we are going to have a newborn baby, and for the first six months, it would be really difficult to go anywhere. So that is like a prolongation on in on its own of uh, Corona. So people are going to to be soon over, and I think. By probably the end of summer, we are going to have like a normal situation where there is not going to be need of any lockdown or any restriction even for restaurant. I mean, I'm dreaming of it. This this can put a toll on the relationship. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. But it, whose fault is that? No, like, it's nobody's fault, but it's just the reality people like are breaking people up. People need to adapt. Uh, to adapt. If you cannot do dating, uh, traditional dating, that you take your uh, your girlfriend uh, somewhere, you should be able to do something like else. A, like a Zoom date. Yeah, that, that, that it sounds really pretty weird. So you uh, send your girlfriend... Uh, oh, you can maybe you can have like uh, something like that. You send your partner a, spe a special package and then you do like... Uh, a meet an online meeting and oh send what I send you. Yeah, wow. I made this cake or this biscuits with my oh, my Lord. or at least it's something. And have, have, a li have a little bit of fantasy, isn't it? If it was me I would make a cake for you while you're in Italy while I'm here and I'm here and I'm eating. And Look what I did for your birthday. Yeah, the problem for me if I send you pasta what you're going to get after probably four days or five days of shipping. Like it's already cooked pasta. Oh, right? Yes. Oh, oh yeah, amazing. <laughs> Beautiful date. You sent me cooked pasta from Italy to here. 
Yeah. yeah. Wow. Well, what should I send you? Very uh, thoughtful. I mean, I think I, I will send you probably a bottle of uh, what is your favorite Italian wine? Moscato. Moscato. A nice bottle of Moscato. No, but I maybe. Maybe instead of doing sending me pasta that you've cooked yourself, maybe your thought that is not going to work and definitely going to be dumped because I get here rotten pasta after three days. Yes, exactly. <laughs> and that's why I say that I cannot do that. Well, you, you also the cake, you cannot send a cake, it's, you're going to get mesh uh, as meshed cake uh, or a dry, like or just, just yeah, cake. unless you send the one for Christmas that uh, I think maybe it might survive. That. Uh, for me, I would send you all product that can like can be old uh, a long time, like not a final dish, probably ingredients. So I'm going to send you salami, okay. and I can send you a, a, almost any sort of cheese. Uh, I mean, that is why I'm always thinking about food. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I can thought also this send conversation you... was about relationship and yeah. the absence of. Uh, Intimacy because we are separated, but yeah, yeah, yeah. and this is like oh, Italian look, intimacy. This, this is the new model of vibrator. I just sent it to you. Ah, okay. okay. And try since we cannot. Meet. <laughs> I don't know how many of those you are going to send, but I mean, it's also a thought. I think it's thoughtful. I would send. Do you know the Hello Fresh box? I think those are good. Shots, uh, the hair should not be soft. I think we are fine. We're fine. Mm -hmm. Also, the, will you also decide? Yeah, eh? Because yeah. I feel like the whole time I was only like this. No, no, you are also like partially here. Okay, let me do that. Really more. But what is this oil really? It is argan oil. Ah, argan oil. It's my new favorite oil. After marula, because marula oil now I think I forgot even the taste. I have not. When, when was the last time? More than two years already? Mm -hmm. Yeah, when we had first. <sighs> The, the this uh, information or our consultation with the hair baron mm -hmm. just like two weeks ago and um, all the things preparation for going to the hospital in labor and stuff mm -hmm. and talking to some friends so I'm just curious and I would love to ask the audience does it make sense for your husband or your partner during birth to be in the delivery room or not? Well, of course, and make all the difference. What, the, what is it? Is that even a question? Yeah, because your friend told you, for example, you shouldn't be in there. Yeah, because uh, I don't know. I mean, it's more like a family's perspective because they said, uh, "Ah, you you can do much for your wife." Shut, shut, uh, thank you, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sorry. I was uh, still playing for your, with your hair. No, 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 no. no. So it, there, there is no playing for me here. No, but what are you doing? I'm just plating them. No, no, today is not them for plating. It's really just because they are plated already. I wanted to do like super bantu notes. Super. No, no, we are not doing super bantu notes today. Wow, wow, they are coming. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't even know this, right? No, no, but. So, does it make sense? Does it not? Because, apart from your friend telling you, mm -hmm. I've also heard uh, about it from other people already who say, no, I prefer that my partner is not there, or partner who say, no. No, like the point of view of my friend that told, told me that, uh, it's like, ah, your, your wife is in pain and you cannot do much for it. Uh, anyway, there is going to be like uh, in this case was that the family was entering, so the mother and the sister. But we don't have this possibility. We are here in Germany by ourselves. So if, if I'm not uh, with you during the, the delivery, nobody is going to be there apart from the doctor. So when I got the information from the hair barber sometime, I also felt like maybe it does not really make sense for you to be there. I want to be there. If I you uh, unless you don't want me to be there, I will. I want to be there. I, I I'm a little bit, you know, not sure what is the best decision because I feel like what role does the men really do? Okay. And from all okay. the YouTube videos I've seen, men were just standing. Yeah, they maybe filming or that is going to be or be looking like they're scared. Like, baby, are you fine? Yeah, are, are, are you in pain? <laughs> <laughs> so how does that help me? Absolutely, make you more nervous. No. 
<laughs> but I, on the other side, you also have to think about like if there is anything going wrong, maybe uh, you then the guy faints. Then the team goes. Not every the guy. guy f- <laughs> 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 Not every guy faint. Come on, eh? Hey? Okay, I'm the I'm the I'm Peter is strong and don't get impressed by blood or anything. So that you've never seen somebody giving birth before. On YouTube, I did. <laughs> I think it's going this to be fine. Eh? It's going to be what? Fun? It's going to be fine, no? I'm just going to be there and do, like, do the breathing coach. Like, <gasps> eh? and, ca- and counting probably like the contraction, how distant our contraction to the other it is. So I say, okay, baby, now it's time to push. Push. And then, so what are the nurses going to be in there? We should then just do it at home since you are so long. Oh, I don't know, or oh, something like that I should be doing. I would be there with the, with the, with the clock, okay, 40 seconds, let's see, Okay. one minute. Okay, so... Because I, at the beginning, uh, the contraction is going to be in probably one every 20 minutes or 15 minutes. Then it, it reduce, it reduce, it reduce until the delivery. The baby comes. I'm not quite experienced. No. Mm. I watch YouTube. Oh, okay. <laughs> or the other way around, I feel like. I'm going to if, irritate me. No, if I want to scratch, hit, bite somebody, it's going to be you. Oh yeah, that, that's it. That's it. Yeah, then you're going to be unfit once the baby is delivered. Right. Oh, maybe you have sore. I don't know. No, swollen no, head. It's fine. Don't you worry. So you think? Or I can give you like you know the uh, some some toys uh, to to squeeze the squeezing toys. <laughs> the one that uh, with the eyes that goes out. Oh, <laughs> okay, not a bad idea. And uh, you just have to think, okay, that is my husband. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the toy is going to be gone really fast. But yeah, I was thinking about it, and I'm like, okay, I'm not sure. Okay, I'm going to buy this using toy. Hmm? Mm-hmm. I'm, I'm waiting. No. I mean, I would want to be in a situation where I can just send them in to go deliver the baby alone while I'm at home. But this is not... Please. <laughs> don't <laughs> talk no sense. <laughs> this is not happening. Oh, yeah. is it happening? No, baby. Okay. I don't have a new channel that I can carry the baby. <laughs> Otherwise, I will send you. As a man, uh, my advice, if there is any man watching this, uh, this YouTube video, is really have a lot of patience. A lot of patience. Just ignore and try to avoid oh, any ignore. possible... Ignore? Ignore, in, in a sense, <laughs> like, ignore possible, like, uh, re- reason of, uh, like, an argument. Just to not, like, just try to avoid any trap to get into an argument. <laughs> because there is no way you are going to win. <laughs> Yeah. Anyway, and uh, you shouldn't be winning because if it, that is going to, if you win, you're going to make, make things worse. So just yeah, try yes, to and make sure you lose also. Yes, in the if, if you're having an argument, you you need to lose, don't you worry? Yeah, but I think uh, so. for me, like this, why I was talking about uh, how the, you know how many relationships are going to make it through, or or how people are coping during this time. It's because back in the day. If, like my go-to if I'm really pissed about, annoyed about just little stuff, I would mm-hmm. just stand up and say, you know what, I'm going to the shopping center. Yeah, I would just drive. And now you, you can, I'm going to the forest. <laughs> yeah, a forest is quite boring. It's not like <laughs> that when it's raining and it's dark like this. It's not like the shopping center. So I feel like that is still the tension that's come from the lockdown. You're like, oh. Or you can go to oh my side. goodness, where do I go now? Uh, mm, restaurant? No. Uh, shopping? No. no. Friends? Uh, I cannot no. because it's forbidden. Uh, uh, like yeah. in prison. Like in the same cell with this, it's like I have a prison partner now. It's no longer just a fun relationship. It's also just weird. Prison. You're really like, it's like what you really do say a chair. We are going to be together forever. About when you have to describe our relationship, it's like being in prison. No, <laughs> <laughs> no, no baby. that's not I, what I'm, I'm saying. I'm, that that really makes me happy, really. Just, I'm <laughs> not saying our relationship is like it's like that, but I'm saying. Mm-hmm. I swear to God, you did not enter a relationship thinking you're going to be 
locked in the house with the person for a whole year. But, uh, yeah, but when you say yes, you are saying, ah, I'm going to be with this person for all my life. Yeah, and I go to work, and sometimes I go to do some trips with my friends. Mm -hmm. We are still together while I'm in Namibia on a, on a girl's trip, and we are yeah, in wherever you went with your friend, Middle East. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you, you, that was normal. Mm -hmm. but, but to, you, you never really thought it's going to be like a year of. We, you are stuck together now for real, for real. For real, for real, bit. Anyways, I think that was it for this weekend from us, guys. If you like the video, please don't forget drop a like, subscribe to the channel, and leave us a comment. Bye bye. bye. Oh, oh.